This tutorial is on importing MARC records into Alexandria. To import your MARC records into Alexandria, you will need to have your circulation screen open. From there, you will go to Tools and to Import. Once you're in Import, select the Item Settings tab down below. Be sure to check the four boxes that I'm showing checked here. Be sure you have Use Imported Barcodes checked, Reassign Duplicate Barcodes checked, Allow Title Updates, and finally, be sure that you have checked the box that says Use Policy Mapping. If you don't check that box, all of your items that you import will go straight into Standard Items. At this point, you should have your CD in your CD drive or your MARC records downloaded onto the desktop of your computer. You can do one of two things to actually upload your items. You can locate your CD, which in this case I have my Follett records. If you move them over on the screen, the only thing you have to do is click, hold down your left mouse button, and drag it over into the screen. If you don't feel comfortable dropping and dragging, the other option to that would be to click your plus sign, your import screen will come open, and you use your drop down box to your folder. In this case, it would be my file at CD, unless you have them on your desktop, and you open to import them into your screen. Once they're imported, you come to the gear. You find the gear and you choose Start Import. You're going to see that it's going to want to do an archive, but you're usually only going to see that if you're using Windows XP. If you're using Windows 7, you may, it may not ask you to do an archive. And then I can see, since I'm using XP, I see my Operation Management screen and I see my Import working. If you are using Windows 7, you will not see this. You won't really see anything that will indicate to you that your records have been uploaded. So we're waiting for these to upload. If you don't think it worked, don't try to upload a second time. What you need to do, if you're not sure, is pull some of your new books, open up your circulation screen, and scan some of your new titles. If the books come up, then you will know that it worked properly. And really, that's all there is to going into Add Your Mark Records.